Hello my friends, today I would like to share an interesting information about the history of the relationship between Korea and Uzbekistan. Many may think that the cooperation between two countries began after the independence of our country. Yes, they are right, as the last 30 years of our cooperation have been mass productive. But what if I tell you an interesting fact, that the relationship between two countries existed in the 6th century, and to prove this, I came to the center of the Silk Road, the city of Samarkand, especially to the museum called Afrasia. Continue watching this video, it will be really interesting. Now we're in the museum with the exhibition of the wall paintings from 6th century. These wall paintings representing the ambassadors from different countries received by the ancient ruler of the Samarkand, Varhuman. All sides of the murals have its own history and meaning of the specific situation. However, today I would like to introduce the western part of the wall. In the left side, it's believed to be painted envoys from ancient East countries, and in the right side, they are from Asian countries who came to praise the King Warhuman. As this video is about Korea, I would like to focus on the two envoys believed to be from ancient Korea. Scientists have proven that ancient Koreans wore feather decorated hats and had a custom of holding hands on their sleeves. Also, same ring pommel swords were discovered in the entire Korean peninsula. So two figures on the western wall seem to describe the unique appearance of ancient Koreans. If they were ancient Koreans, why did they go all the way to Samarkand about a thousand kilometers away from their country? We cannot get a right answer to this question. But we can say that it's the evidence of the Uzbekistan and Korea's long history of relationship. So, how was the information on the video? Do you want to see the unique wall paintings in real life? Welcome to Uzbekistan, and thank you. Hello guys, welcome to Pakistan. Um, I'm in my hometown in the middle of the street. It is really embarrassing that I'm on my way to a Korean convenience store because my uh, I got a mission from my dad that we're out of Potudan in our house, so I'm going to buy some and show you Korean convenience stores that you can find in all Kazakhstan cities. Let's go! This was a quick tour. Thank you so much for watching till the end and I hope you'll come to Kazakhstan one day.